You're watching All Around PC. Uh, we are here at the uh, Razor booth. Why are saying we are here? I'm going to be here all weekend. Uh, I'm here at the Razor booth, and these guys come to join us. Um, it's at IFA Berlin 2016, and this is Razor booth, and I'm going to be showing you the next cool thing from Razor. So you've seen the Onata um, on that amazing video with the incredible outro from me, uh, but now I'm going to show you the Stargazer camera, which is uh, aimed firmly at broadcasters, so YouTubers and streamers, and it's a very cool camera. So if you spin around here, I'll just talk you through what this amazing bit of kit can do. So this is the uh, Stargazer at the top here, and you can see my fat face down there, and this is just running uh, just a small version of XSplit with just a single scene. So uh, the Stargazer has two lenses here, which are basically uh, working like a pair of eyes, because it's got uh, two lenses it can see in 3D, because it's got two slightly different vantage points. And then the last sensor on the end there is an infrared sensor for help with seeing depth. Now the cool thing about the Stargazer is, because it's using Intel RealSense, it, uh, works with facial recognition. So what that does is it actually tracks eyes, nose and mouth, okay, or big fat hairy double chins as well, uh, within a 3D space. And what that allows us to do is to do in-camera green screen or chroma keying, which means that you don't need to have all your green screen set up of like uh, your lights here, your camera there, and then like you know, three meters away, you put your green screen and your other cameras and uh, sorry, your other lights and light your green screen separately. You haven't got to do any, all, any of that we literally, if you spin the camera around so you can see what else is in the room, there's literally just a black wall to one side of me there, a black wall behind me, um, and I'm now gonna chroma key myself. So this is just a backdrop you can see there. That's the backdrop of uh, XSplit. I've got the camera down in the corner here. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna make sure the camera's selected within XSplit, which it is, and we're gonna right click on the camera. We select Intel RealSense. So this is where we normally select our chroma key, so we can select the green screen or whatever. So we select Intel RealSense. It starts working in the background there, and then we go back to me, this will reboot in a second. And there we go. It's recognized my face and it's picking up the light from the camera there. No, it's fine, we'll leave it in there. So yeah, there you go. So it's recognizing my face. It's actually tracking my eyes, my nose and my mouth. Okay, so if I lean back, it's not just doing depth of field. You can see there and it's tracking me and it's tracking really high frame rate as well. So it's also understanding like, you know, that I'm operating on a plane and so there's, there's me there. But we can actually, should be able, if I'm just gonna actually flip this round, so this is the cool thing, I'm gonna just change the layout here. I'm gonna flip it round so it's uh, more natural, so it's more of a mirrored mode, there we go. You see, and now I'm raising this hand. And we can bring in, um, we can bring in Marcel, fantastic volunteer, he didn't know he was gonna be doing this, okay? Uh, Marcel's gonna come in as well, I'm gonna come join me. So Marcel, if you literally just lean in, lean, lean, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, lean in, lean in, get, get your face down, come yeah. forward. I'm gonna go back, yeah, and we should, in a second, if we're both at the same level, pick us both up. Right, so I'm just going to refresh the camera, and with a bit of luck, it will pick us both up. It's not seeing you, you've got to get in closer, I think. Why doesn't it like, it's uh, got your hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll my hand. Yeah. Oh, obviously, obviously the camera doesn't like you. There you go, yeah. and we're both in. So, this, so we had to just quickly reset the camera, okay, so that it would then look for another face, but this will actually support up to four faces in one time. So I've just come back from an event in uh, the UK, uh, called Insomni 58, where we were streaming, and we had four people using this all at the same time. Yeah, uh, the lighting in here is not brilliant because you're lit from above, so it's kind of not seeing you, you very well, but if I come back to the level with you, it should pick you up better. There you go. So if you're all on the same plane, then it picks you up much easier. There you go. So that is the Intel RealSense camera. It's going to be available in October, and pricing is 169 euros or 149 pounds. I have to say pounds because I'm from the UK. All right, and I know also there's uh, lots of UK viewers as well on All Around PC. So yeah, um, available for, in October. We're announcing today that you can pre-order it from the Razer store, but you're going to be able to buy it in bricks and mortar stores from October, November onwards, something like that. Okay. Time for the very professional outro, which is basically saying, check back soon on All Around PC for more from Aoife Berlin 2016, but none of it's gonna be as good as the two videos you've seen here with me, because they don't pay me to do this stuff anymore. <laughs>